Welcome back. We're continuing to follow breaking news this morning. WNBA star Brittany Griner is coming home. President Biden announcing her release in the last hour or so. In exchange, the U.S. is returning Victor Boot, a Russian weapons dealer imprisoned in the U.S. for armed smuggling. And uh, Mitch is back to explain exactly what we know about Victor Boot. Well, there are two main reasons why this isn't just unmitigated joy. It is great news, undisputed, that Brittany Griner is home. However, the person that is released in order for her to come home is Victor Boot, who we're going to talk about in a minute. And then also Paul Whelan, a, a former U.S. Marine who has been there for almost four years exactly, is still incarcerated in Russia. So we're going to talk about Victor Boot, and then we'll talk about Paul Whelan a little bit. But first of all, Boot, uh, he was sentenced to a 25-year prison sentence in 2012, but the United Nations, the UN, has been investigating him since the early to mid-1990s. He's accused of supplying arms to the bloody conflicts in Africa, in Liberia, and Sierra Leone. He is accused of providing arms to the Taliban in Afghanistan. Uh, the United States actually froze his bank accounts and prevented him from making transactions in the United States in 2004. So the United States has been at least uh, seeing him as an enemy of this country since 2004. He was arrested in 2008 in Thailand. Now there he was accused of trying to sell weapons to the Fuerzas Armadas Revolucionarias de Colombia, the FARC. That is uh, considered to be a far left terrorist group in Colombia. Uh, and uh, the FARC uh, is, uh, was actually in that situation in Thailand. The FARC was represented uh, by U.S. people, uh, Americans who were uh, conducting a sting operation, trying to get Boot to sell them arms. He did agree to sell them those arms, according to the law enforcement there. Uh, he was charged in 2008 and arrested. He was extradited from Colombia in 2010. The U.S. said the weapons would eventually be used to kill Americans. Um, he, so he's accused of fueling all of these conflicts. It's important to note, too, that uh, Boot was interviewed and asked about these specific accusations. He's denied all of them. But again, this is the person that is now walking free. And it is a major concern, especially right now, as Russia is in the middle of an armed conflict with Ukraine, that a arms dealer is now free. And now again, the thank you for watching. Go to newsnationnow.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.